uh, get last game before the break. Ivod Sportsbook Review.com, Music City Bowl, Nashville, Nebraska against Tennessee. Tennessee, six and a half, 58 the total. Injuries here. Armstrong, doubtful. Westerkamp will not play. Certainly helps out a Tennessee defense that was atrocious down the stretch. Yeah, well, I mean, Tennessee's atrocious down the stretch. The teams that Tennessee was giving up points in bunches to down the stretch, they didn't have quarterbacks. They didn't have playmakers. Uh, I mean, it, it was a complete disaster. Kentucky, Missouri, Vanderbilt, last three games of the season, 118 points, 1,886 yards against that Tennessee defense. That's not a mispronunciation. That's 628 yards per game over that span. It's as ugly as it gets. And, uh, you know, this is the defense that will be a little bit healthier now than it was in those final three games, but not a lot. You know, they suffered a good handful of season-ending injuries among that front seven. Of course, that includes the linebacker, Jalen Reeves-Mabin. That's a problem for Tennessee when it comes to getting stops. A team that, you know, who was supposed to be really good on both sides of the football ended up being not so good at either. Well, is anybody, who's excited to be here? I mean, Tennessee had a chance to get in a major bowl game and they were blown out by Vandy. They were the pick to win the SEC East and they went 4-4 four and four in conference play. Yeah, I, I don't want any part of Tennessee in this ball game. Let me make that very clear. It's Nebraska or pass for me and that has a lot to do with the attitude here. You know, yeah, Nebraska has a ton of injuries. Their quarterback's not likely to play. Their leading receiver's not likely to play. They're all Big Ten safety. Nathan Gary, his backup, Boaz Joseph, both ineligible. But even with those losses, all the reports I've read, this team's pretty excited about getting the opportunity to beat an SEC foe in a major bowl game. And, and uh, you know, Mike Riley seems done well in bowls. You know, 7-2 and two straight up, dating back to his days at Oregon State, this is a squad that kind of fell apart down the stretch, but may have an opportunity here to take advantage of a defense that certainly wasn't very good when it mattered most. Hey guys, for the full video, go to sbrpicks.com. That's right, the 8th Annual SBR Forum Bash will be held at the breathtaking, all-inclusive Hard Rock Hotel in Punta Cana on Super Bowl weekend. Join Natalie Rydstrom and the Odds Couple as they mingle with SBR pros and have fun under the sun. Stay tuned for video coverage of bash activities, including a $5,000 poker tournament sponsored by uwager.eu. Only on SBR, your sportsbook authority since 1999.